the year is still 2169. Despite my best efforts using stronger shape base building principles, the Martian architects still attack me on a daily basis. I'm worried all hope for Mars is lost, that curved walls and glass floors will be the future for this planet, but I must continue to fight for engineering. Yes, hello fellow engineers and welcome back to Hostile Mars. We'll be continuing where we left off last time, which is one of these? Why Why are there three save files? Ah yes, this is the base that you all know and love. Right, we're in the right place. Let's just kill these pesky architects. Oh, I got the shotgun equipped. Back to the pistol, I think. You guys don't deserve a shotgun. But before we head back, what? what is this? Is this a new resource? Dolomite node. Let's harvest some of that. We'll give it a boosh. And we got the standard Mars rock. And as before, all those rocks go straight into our ass. Our very, very muscular ass. And then we've also got a basalt node, which I think just gives us basalt, which again goes into our ass. So we can also loot everything that's about. I think, are these regened? I feel like I've been here before. Maybe after every save, they regen, which is cool. But anyway, we'll slide back down to our base. But first, a massive thank you to Apex Gaming PCs for sponsoring today's video. We've teamed up to bring my own custom line of PCs that I actually helped to create. Now, I won't lie, these pre-builds do cost more than building your own PC. But it takes all the hassle out of it and you know it's been set up properly. The reason I've always chosen pre built myself. So if you're thinking of joining the PC Master Race, consider checking out my line at the link below. And if you use code ENGINEER, you'll get a 5% discount. Thanks Apex for supporting the channel, but let's get back to some destruction. And this is where we got to last time. So we're in the recycler, we can take things like the spring, shove them in here, and then that turns them into useful materials that we can build with. And then in our tech tree, we can unlock various things things so i think we're gonna do some automation at the start of this so let's unlock the scrap rock harvester that's oh no that's gonna take 24 red blobs we've only got 15 and the only way to get red blobs is to come into here and we've gotta we gotta start an enemy wave so that is started and coming from up there Hello, there man. are enemies so we've got to defend these we've got some laser turrets here that are pretty much useless i need to try and upgrade them uh, let's use my shotgun to boosh <laughs> wow that that worked pretty well Boosh, boosh. Okay, let's try and let's wait for these guys to group up. I don't want to waste my ammo. Nice. There we go. There we go. Get back. Get back, architect scum. And then we'll just destroy these balls around here. And the wave is complete. Meaning we can pick up all of these resources, including the red balls that we need. And then in the top left, oh, we've only we've only got 21. We need to we need to do more. Oh no, I lied. Ah. Oh, so when you click on the home base, everything up here, all your balls up there, they go into your machine. So we've actually got 36. So we can unlock that now. So scrap rock harvester, you are unlocked. Meaning if we come around to here to our craft bench, we can now craft the scrap rock harvester. We just need four iron bars and some resource. Oh, I don't know. Do I know how to make an iron bar yet? So over here in this machine, we can turn Mars rock into iron ore. I wonder, can I put iron ore up there? No, we need to try and work out how to make iron ore. Ah, oh, I guess it's it's probably the blast furnace, right? Aha, look, we need the blast furnace too. That allows us to make iron and magnesium bars. That needs 80 red blobs. Oh man, that is a lot because that means we need to survive more waves, which probably means I'm better off investing in some defenses. So let's see what a scrap launcher turret is. That costs eight blobs to unlock. And in order to craft that, we need five scrap metals, one electromagnet and one wire. Well, we can craft an electromagnet out of four scrap metals and two wires. So let's build two of those, I guess. And then we've got all our resources to build the scrap launcher turret. So let's build two of those and then holy this is huge. What is this? All right, let's come up here and then I want it facing out there, I guess. Or perhaps I could do them like one there and one there. So if they come into my base, they're going to get blasted in the face. Oh, that was a rhyme. Oh, look, and we can upgrade these to 50 scrap metal and 50 energy thing. Ooh, ooh, can I? Does that mean I can upgrade these? I'd love to upgrade this scrap laser turret. It is pretty useless. Oh, it doesn't have doesn't have an upgrade button. Anyway, we've got to add ammo. I've just added 50 scrap metal pellets to each of those. I am going to move my turrets forward. So we got those like that. Let's see what these do. Oh, actually, this is my shotgun. Look, bottom right, I've got zero ammo. How do I make shotgun ammo? Shotgun ammo. We need scrap metal pellets scrap metal oh we need weak explosive powder all right to make that we need scrap metal and magnesium ore i don't think we've 
I don't think we've found magnesium yet, have we? Unless, if I were to process my dolomite, would that make magnesium? I've got to upgrade this in order to do that. So I need 100 scrap metal and 100 energy cells. I've got 110 scrap metal. I've only got I've only got 70 energy cells. So I guess what I could do, we could go for a little wander. Let's try and see what's about. So I need, I need energy cells. There's some. Nice. So we're just going to do lots of looting, a little bit of shooting. Watch these guys break dance. <laughs> Oh, the recoil of their gun makes them go flying. It's hilarious. We can even do a little bit of booshing on these piles because that sends stuff straight into our buttocks. Now, that gave us loads of energy cells. Nice. And then what do we have over here? Oh, we've got a hut. Let's head inside this hut. Uh, oh, it doesn't It doesn't have a door. <laughs> okay, that's random. That is, that is a product of architecture. That's why we're trying to banish them from Mars. Anyway, up here, we've got a few more things. You got some gun stuff got some poles some scrap computers oh and we've got more evidence of architecture look they've literally they've tried to do an overhanging cantilever without any engineering so the floors all fallen through are you responsible for this it was you wasn't it it was you i mean look at it man all the exposed cables and <sighs> Right, anyway, I think we got a fair amount of loot once we dig this up. So we'll head back to our base. And remember, we got double jump. We unlocked that last time. So we can jump into our base. Nice. And we finally have the resources to upgrade this, the material processor. So, ooh, that is nice and upgraded now. Meaning we can put dolomite in. And what does that give us? Please be magnesium. Yes, we've got magnesium ore. So we'll take all 14 of those, build the max amount of weak explosive powder, which means we can then select the shotgun ammo and build the max amount of that. So now we've got 168 shotgun shells, which means we can start the next enemy wave. Oh, it's, it's wave 10. I wonder if anything interesting will happen. I'm very intrigued to see how these guys are going to work as well. Let's just let this guy come in. Oh, he's not coming in. He's not coming in. Oh, oh yes, they're working. They are working. I haven't even shot my gun yet. I didn't even need my ammo. Boosh, get back. Oh no, we've lost some wool. We've lost some wool. Oh, we've lost a lot of wool. Where did you guys come from? <laughs> oh wow, okay. I thought I thought our walls were invincible. Where did you come from, you bully bastard? All right, that is the wave complete. Man, we need to be careful. I assume they attacked us from this direction somewhere. We'll have to pay attention next time. We are no longer safe though. Thankfully, lots of Red Bulls and other resources for us to pick up. Unfortunately... We must rebuild our walls. So let's recycle all the resources we just got. Let's also unlock some ammo regen, a Paragon bot manual, which apparently is a field manual containing information about the parts and pieces used to construct Paragon bots. I don't know what Paragon bot is, but I think I want one. Oh, and when we get two more red blobs, we need 25. We only got 23. We can unlock a makeshift projectile turret. So what I might do, I might invest in like the scrap spikes, the clash of clans, spring traps. And then if I build my walls back and perhaps move one of these scrap launchers over to here then i think any enemies that come from this way i assume they came from up there i'll have to keep an eye out but that should mean hopefully our walls won't get destroyed as much maybe potentially we'll see what happens all right i then want to craft some spike traps which means i need a couple of electromagnets so we'll craft a few of those and then for the spring trap it seems we do actually need to keep the springs so i have been recycling those perhaps now is the time where we can actually build with some of our scrap okay well, anyway i'm gonna build some spikes over here oh look they go into the ground if we do two there we'll do a couple over here as well and we'll take on the next enemy wave all right so i'm gonna try and defend from up the top just to keep these guys back a bit. Get back. Oh, the shotgun is so good. I love the shotgun. Boosh. Boosh. And then... Oh, no. There's, there's enemies. They've got straight in. How did you get in? Get back. Get back. I think my spike traps are springing them over the top. Yeah, look. They're just bouncing them up. <laughs> so I think the balls that hit my spike traps, they literally just got flung into my base. So perhaps we have to move them. <laughs> Oh, that was a fail. Right, I'm going to start filling my storage crate with these parts because I think we can build with them now. So we don't want to scrap everything we've got anymore. We'll head up here to collect all the resources of the dead. Rebuild our walls. Pick up these spike traps. Or actually, perhaps... Now, this is a bit of engineering. Perhaps this will work. So if we shove four spike traps there and then we build walls around that, that would allow us to build a platform up there. Because look, in this game, it's, it's literally engineering. Like, you can't can't just build that there there's nothing supporting it so what i'm thinking if i do that and yes i realize i've just made my first bridge in the game 
Wow. Uh, hopefully as things come in here, they'll get spike trapped into the ceiling and they might like go... Don't know. We'll have to see what happens. We can now unlock the projectile turret. So let's start that research. I then should probably save up for the blast furnace too. That requires 80. Aha, but now we can make a gun turret with a tripod base, a hoverbot gun scrap and some wires. Now I know I've got those two. We just need to make a tripod base. So if we head back, we can actually make that here. We just need... A scrap bracket and a hover module so in my crate there's a bracket there's a hover module i think we're good so we'll make that and then we'll go to the makeshift gun turret we'll make one of those so there it goes we have made the gun turret let's take that and let's shove that up here do you think that's gonna is that gonna move or does it only shoot forwards i don't know so i've just given it a hundred ammo let's take on the next wave i guess i'm quite intrigued to see if this works i hope so so here they come you can see they're coming from that way where do they come from over there oh they do come they come from the ramp as well interesting good to know i'm gonna muller these guys oh they're all grouped together that is perfect shotgun stuff quick reload that's it that's it oh god this is quite a big wave this is quite a big wave where did you all come from right is my thing working oh, i think it's working there's death there there is death oh man there's so many i think i need to help them a little bit ah there's this is a big wave this is a really big wave it's never ending <laughs> We are losing walls on this side, though. Yes, look at the spike traps. <laughs> Love it. Ow, I'm actually getting hurt. I'm actually getting hurt. Get back, get back. Right, anyone left? Where are you? The wave hasn't finished. Or oh, is it you? You, you architect. Boosh. All right, let's collect all the resources up. Lots up here. Nice. And as you can see, this turret, it was actually aiming over there. So this, this looks directions. These ones, absolutely useless. Don't do anything. But this one takes ammo. These ones don't. So I guess it's not all bad. Anyway, let's build another tripod. Let's build another turret since we did get another gun that time. And then this one, I might actually shove like over here in this corner. Add some ammo, rebuild some walls. And then I know I was saving for the blast furnace, but I'm, I'm tempted by the electrocution trap. It costs 20 red things. Let's give it a go. Let's unlock it. All right, so to make this electrocution pole thing, we need nine scrap, 12 capacitors, nine wires, and three poles. I think I've got all of those except for the scrap. So let's just come over to the recycler. We'll recycle some stuff that we have excess of. I mean, I feel like putting these gun parts in also gets us a good amount of scrap. Yeah, because each one is like 20 or so. So I think we'll, we'll go up to about that point take all of those put half in this furnace and half in this furnace so that means they're both making our scrap metal at the same time and that means we can build these electrocution poles and then we can head up here and see how they work so it looks like they just use the triangle technology which is sort of it's old school engineering that we've moved on in the modern era to the strongest shape but since we're still we're still at the start of the game of this i guess that's why it's a triangle still uh, what i might do i might just put this can i put this on this ramp and that one, it's got an electricity symbol. Does that mean if I put it there? Oh, I think it's too far away. Can I shove it there? Okay, that works. Oh, it says there I've got to add ammo. Oh, why do these take ammo? Everything takes ammo in this game. I thought they'd just use the wireless Bluetooth technology we've got going on. Anyway, let's start the next wave. My bloke, he's a bit shaky about that. He's not sure. But come on, mate. We got this. We got this. We'll do a bit of spawn killing as they come down. Boosh, boosh, boosh. Oh, look at all that. Okay, there's, there's quite a lot of them. I might have to I might have to drop back a bit. All right, okay, let's head back. Let's head back. Yeah, we're about to be attacked from over here. So boosh. Boosh. Oh, the spike traps are doing the business. Where are my electrical ones? Oh yeah, they're doing they're doing really well. Get back. Oh, this is actually working okay, I think. Right, there's these blue robots. I think these are a bit stronger than usual. But, ah, we've lost a wall. We've lost a wall. <laughs> you knobheads. Thankfully, they're all still going the trap way. They're not the most intelligent. They are architects after all. Right, and that is the wave completed. We... We actually did pretty well there. We lost one wall piece and that's it. There's so many resources to collect. Nom, 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 nom. I think that's a gun one that I don't have space in my inventory for. That will allow us to build another turret. So let's just shove that into there. Maybe that one as well. Then we can go grab that gun. And there was another one here. Yeah, nice. So we can actually build two more turrets this time. Let me just replace this wall whilst we're here. Oh, I need that wall as well. Damn it. Anyway, look top left. We got... 57 red blobs for that which means if we put them into our home base we go into the tech tree we've got 99 so i am going to unlock 
the blast furnace too because that will allow us to make the bars and then we can use that to automate meanwhile we'll make two tripods use those to make two turrets we'll plonk them over here and over here add some ammo to each oh and we can actually turn these scrap segments into the metal pellets uh, and the reason we need to do that is over here these scrap launchers their ammo is the metal pellets so we'll stock those back up shove a wall back there and then with twice the number of turrets hopefully we should be good All right hold Hold, 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 fire. Oh God, I've let them get too close. I should have shot earlier. No, we're good, we're good. We're pushing them back, we're pushing them back. Oh man, there are so many, there are so many. There's so many resources like rolling into me. It's, it's beautiful. All right, I really need to go and check on the other side. All right, let's go, let's go over here. Oh no, I'm out, of, I'm out of shotgun ammo. We're back to the pistol. Oh man, this thing feels so pathetic now. Oh, they, they definitely take a few hits, but that is the wave completed. I'll tell you what, that worked really really well so let's collect all these resources from up here oh there's so many there's so many i think some fell off yeah they did I'll grab all those oh we are getting some red blobs now we got 71 that round so i'm going to research the scrap delivery bot and then i'm going to see what i need to build a blast furnace too or does it just does it just upgrade my furnace oh it just upgrades them okay that's awesome so now i can literally just put some iron ore in there and it will get me the iron bars so insert max iron ore that's creating iron bars and then we can make the scrap rock harvester which i assume we can then take this up here these are like a large mars rock node so it looks like it's got an axe on the front so if we rotate it that way put it about there why aren't you doing anything do you need to be on top of it or something oh there we go there we go okay so that is hammering away so if we interact with that i assume this will fill up with rock at some point maybe oh it just it destroyed the rock and now it's run out and it didn't even collect anything what <laughs> <laughs> what have I built? What is this machine? Okay, well, that's digging that. I'm not seeing any resources being produced, though. So... <laughs> Unless maybe we need the delivery bot first. So to build a delivery bot, we need scrap metal poles and a frame scrap, which we've got all of those. So let's build one of those. So it's an automatic delivery bot, very slow and very low capacity. So if I shove you there, what? Oh my goodness, it's got propellers for wheels. All right, and now it's just, now it's just there. I can't even, I can't even pick it up. I don't, how do I make them work? That, that's just there now. Okay, well, that was a waste of time. Could it be because that's destroyed the rock? Let's, let's move this to another rock. All right, we'll shove it there and then we'll see if that thing moves over here. You gonna go collect it, mate? No, no. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> All right, well, I'm gonna research making my turrets better. Then we'll take on another wave. And these waves are getting pretty big now. It's a little bit frightening. Oh man, there's there's so many coming. What are you doing? Let's go check on our base. Oh, our base is getting ruined. Ah, ah, get back, get back. Oh man, there's so many. They've knocked one of my walls out in knobheads. All right, that is the wave complete. Look at all these red balls just rolling down the hill. Love to see it. Then we'll collect all the parts out here, all the parts that fell off down here, and then all the parts up here as well. And then I'm going to think about upgrading these things. So if we interact, to upgrade, we need 50 scrap metals and 50 energy cells so i've got the energy cells we just need some scrap metal now thankfully i have been making that so i've got 53 here let's upgrade this one and see what happens so we can see the damage will go up the tracking will go up the range so oh look at that it's visual our guy is shaking in excitement and the next upgrades are unlocked presumably because they need to be researched and i'm gonna guess that research isn't in here so if we go back you can see we're in the scrap age once we get into the iron age yeah, we get all sorts. We get assemblers, and then we get way better turrets. Beam turrets, Tesla turrets. But I'm guessing, do we need to unlock everything in the scrap age to get to the Iron Age? Maybe. But I think that might be one for another time, because I need to rebuild this. I then need to try and upgrade my other turrets and stuff as well. But yeah, that's this is fun. This is fun. I feel like it's quite, sort of quite a slow-paced game. I thought I'd be upgrading faster than this. So let me know in the comments what you think. Perhaps this should move on to, like, to be like a streaming series, rather Rather than a YouTube one. Is it a bit too slow paced for YouTube? I don't know. Let me know. But for now, I'll say peace, love, and chonky gun turrets. Bye, guys.